Board of Trustees January 16, 2019 meeting to order. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. <coughs> I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Okay, roll call. Mr. Galloway. I'm here. Mr. Malcheski. Present. Mrs. Luda. Here. Okay. Organizational regular trustees meeting minutes. I have no changes. Okay. Nor do I. Okay, we will pass those. Approve those. Elected official reports. Fiscal officer, Secretary I, Sexton, Amy Dawes. I have none. Thank you. Connie? None. Chris? It's supposed to snow this weekend. Be safe. Okay. <laughs> I have also limited reports, so we'll move to the department uh, report, administration department, Andy Rose. Thank you, Mr. Melchesky, members of the board, Mrs. Dawson, good evening. A uh, couple of quick updates. The Concord mobile app is, is nearing completion. We're conducting some final reviews and it should be released, we're hoping, by early February. Uh, that's both for Android and uh, iPhone users. Uh, I'd like to give a hats off to the service department. Um, they've been very busy recently ensuring our roads are safe for travel. They were actually out at 2 a.m. this morning. Um, the public service announcement, ODOT is going to be making some minor uh, signal adjustments to the Auburn Cryle intersection. Uh, this primarily deals with the signals for motorists that are traveling north on Cryle, and they're going to adjust those to ensure motorists aware that you can't continue and treat that as a right on red uh, getting on to Auburn. <clears throat> so they're gonna be making some minor signal adjustments there. Uh, and the last thing is a, a winter is a great time to clean out basements, garages, and closets. Um, it's a prime opportunity for you to participate in our spring garage sale that's taking place uh, March 15th and 16th at our community center and you can contact the Recreation Department for further details. And that concludes my report. Thank you, sir. Okay, um, new business. Old business. Old business, yeah, December yeah. financial reports. I forgot about the December financial reports. That's right. I, I, did not, I did not have them done at the last meeting. Right. They are completed now. I'm used to always having I'm a sorry. no old business in right. December financial reports always approved. Mr. Chairman, I make a motion to approve the December financial reports as uh, presented by the fiscal officer. I will second that. All in favor say aye. 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 A new business, uh, permission to advertise for bids for Christian Avenue and Jason Avenue reconstruction projects. So moved. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Credit card policy. Be the second credit card policy today for me. There you go. Really? Yes. No. Um, we have a credit card policy that has been um, uh, drafted, reviewed by legal counsel, um, uh, sent to trustees, and reviewed by trustees. And I make a motion to approve the credit card policy um, as it has been provided to us. Second. I'll favor say aye. Aye. Uh, it's a hot item for auditors this year, I guess. <laughs> well, the, yep. the law goes into effect February 2nd, so. Hmm. Yep. Everybody has to have one officially on the books. Mm -hmm. Concord always had a very strict process, but now we have to have something in writing within the uh, handbook, so. Good. Uh, fire department accept the resignation of part-time firefighter John Pitchell. Anybody want to make a motion? So no. move. I will, may, I will second that, knowing effective. that it's effective January, January 14th, 14th, 2019. Right. All in favor say aye. 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 Mr. Chairman, I make a motion to accept the resignation of probationary firefighter Anthony Ferrito, effective January 14th, 2019. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Uh, Mr. Chairman, um, uh, under the guidelines of the service department's um, STEP program, um, I make a motion to provide for a step increase for Joe Williams to $24.60 per hour effective January 1st, 2019. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 Um, under the same heading, I make a motion to approve a step increase to $22.19 per hour for Clayton Ansel effective January 1st, 2019. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 And then just to remind everyone that we've had a step program in the service department for 
about four years ago. I was going to say oh, six. Yeah, no, six. Frank yeah. brought it on board when yeah. he came. Well, it took me a little while to, to get it in there, Implement as I recall. It, but but yeah. and it's been I think a while. It's, it's, it's working well. So. Yes. Um, and congratulations to both those, those gentlemen. Um, you have a vote uh, for a letter of recognition for the Eagle Scout, Jordan Thomas Snyder. Mr. Rose. Thank you, Mr. Galloway. Um, it is with great pleasure that the <laughs> trustees of Concord Township extend their congratulations to Jordan Thomas Snyder for attainment of the very prestigious honor of Eagle Scout. Anyone who has known a scout understands the hard work and dedication that accompanies the achievement of Eagle Scout. However, it is certainly worth noting that only about 2% of your peers will achieve this same rank and that you will stand among those Eagle Scouts that have become great leaders in this country. Your Eagle Scout project to help area children still in foster care by raising money and collecting clothing helped over 68 Lake County foster children from the ages of three months to 17 years old, and that's very commendable. Your understanding of the importance to give back to your community by volunteering at St. Gabriel Church Summer Vacation Bible School and serving your troop as patrol leader, chaplain's aide, librarian, and assistant patrol leader exemplifies the ideals and goals of scouting through leadership and service. Eagle Scouts are leaders by the nature of their accomplishments, which you'll have had the opportunity to expand upon through your education and participation in community service. We wish you the best as you pursue a degree in psychology, and we look forward to watching you grow as a future community leader. Congratulations on becoming an Eagle Scout. Sincerely, the Concord Board the Concord Township Board of Trustees. I move we approve the letter. I'll second. All in favor say aye. 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 Congratulations to Jordan. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> and then we have another one for business of the year, Conway <clears throat> land title. Those, do we? Do we have to approve? Do we have to read that? We don't have to read them. I would um, I would make a motion to approve the letter of recognition for business of the year Conway land title. I'll second that. All in favor say aye. 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 He's a Concord resident. Yep, and doing a great job. Um, I would also make a motion to uh, approve the letter of recognition for Beacon Award winner, the Perry Center of Lake County. Second. All in favor say aye. 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 <clears throat> There's a, a vote for the Myler of Quill Hollow number 11. Uh, phase one. Phase one final plan. I'll, I'll move that we approve that. I will second. All in favor say aye. 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 And I will move to approve uh, Quail Hollow number 11, phase two final plat, planned unit development. I will second that. All in favor say aye. 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 We will sign those. We're signing these. Uh, we need to set a public hearing on, uh, for a zoning map amendment and a preliminary plan application uh, 1118-5 for, uh, from Summers Real Estate Group LLC for proposed residential conservation development R2 RCD district on the portion of land currently known as permanent parcel number 08A0020008. 0, whose address is 12395 Winchell Road. As further described in Exhibit A being 24.6198 acres of land, the site is located off of Winchell Road, south of Concord Hamden Road, north of Meredith Lane and adjacent to the Concord Ridge subdivision. How about... Um, Get out my calendar and take a look here. I assume we will be able to do this. Would that be a populated one? If we know. I kind of doubt it. I'm going to do 715 then. On I mean, it's, it, it, was not, uh, it was not a hot potato item. No. Over at 715, zoning. it's or 725 on the, on the 6. Why don't you do uh, 715? Start on time then? Yeah, I mean, or you can even do seven. I mean, it gives time for everybody to give a discussion of what it is and if there is any questions. But okay, seven. It's seven. up to you, Mr. Chairman. All right, seven o'clock is fine. We'll put it seven. Seven o'clock. We can have an abridged office hours. Yeah. 
Um, we'll make, make a note that that'll be modified from 6.30 to 7. We can afford that since we have a staff meeting the day before. All right, so we'll set that at 7 o'clock on February 6, uh, 2019. Okay. Um, also included is that uh, these offices will be closed here on Monday in observance of Martin Luther King Day. That's mm -hmm. January 21st. On Friday, January 25th at 9 a.m., we will have a strategic planning meeting in the community center. Uh, Tuesday, uh, February 5th at 9 a.m., we have a staff meeting in the conference room. At 7 p.m., the zoning commission meeting in town hall. And then on February 6th at 10 a.m., we will have a bid opening for Christian and Jason reconstruction project in town hall. 6.30, the trustee's office hours, 7 o'clock, the public hearing that we just set, and then the trustees meeting again at 7.30. Bingo. Anything else for the good of the order? All right, guys, be safe. Winter has started, so uh, I will close our January 16th, 2019 meeting. Thank you. Very efficient. Watch out.